Hey my friends, Mike from Arms Only Gaming. I hope you're having a lovely day. You know, it doesn't matter how many times you play a certain game. There's always something new popping up somewhere. Now, if you haven't seen my most popular video on my channel, uh, How to Summon Henrik, uh, there's a, a, a very long video on explaining on how to summon Henrik, how you have to speak to Eileen in, in the beginning of the game, and how you can later use Henrik to help you fight the Shadows of Yarnum and uh, Rom the Vacuous Spider. But I just came across something very weird now. I was doing a playthrough and um, I skipped the whole Eileen thing because I was doing footage for another video. And all of a sudden this happened. Um, it's kind of weird because I skipped the whole first part of speaking to Eileen and all of a sudden I was attacked by Hendrik out of nowhere. But as an added bonus, um, Eileen just spawned out of nowhere to come and help me fight him. So yeah, check out this video my friends because it's quite freaky. I'll see you guys inside. As you can see my friends, I'm running around near Odin's Chapel. This was footage that I was collecting for another video. Uh, I did speak to Eileen the second time after I opened up the gates in the Cathedral Ward as mentioned in the previous video. So I didn't think it would make any difference because I didn't speak to her the first time in Central Yarnum. So, yeah, I saw her standing there next to the chapel, I spoke to her. She actually gave me the first dialogue, not the second dialogue. I thought, oh, well, it's not, it's not that weird. Um, but like I was saying, I was gathering this footage for another video. I noticed the little light on top of the, the building there. That's the brooch you need to pick up from the little girl's mother that's been killed by Gascoigne. So, okay, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to move on to my next um, phase of my next video that I wanted to do. So I'm just walking through the, the graveyard and look what happens here. All of a sudden Henrik just pops out out of nowhere and he starts attacking me and I think figure okay well if this is happening then Eileen is gonna come down and she's gonna come and help me uh, to kill him. So she's supposed to run through these gates the main gates that you open up to go to Odin's Chapel. We still haven't seen her. Henrik is following me so I'm just gonna run to this uh henry where are you oh there, oh, there he is okay, wait, right. let me just um just gave him a smack there you see as eileen still hasn't turned up going up the ladder she was supposed to come this way he's not following me so i figured okay i'm gonna go kill him now look in the background through that alleyway now all of a sudden get the camera right here you can see Eileen running there in the background now she's here where she came from I don't know so it's it's probably a little in-game glitch that went wrong because I didn't follow the sequence properly but uh yeah now she's killing Hendrik in a completely different way and place so I'm gonna get rid of him here very quickly and the funny thing is after this he was still available to summon Remember, if you want to summon Hendrik, follow the steps in my previous video, but remember to equip the Imperity Ruin that you get from the Master of the League, Walter, in that little building next to the Lantern in the Forbidden Woods. You have to get that Ruin from him, the Imperity Ruin, and you have to equip it in order for Hendrik's, Hendrik's summon sign to show up. But yeah, this was a, it was a funny one for me, this one. I didn't... Like I said, my friends, memory doesn't matter how many times you've played a game, something new always pops up. But I hope you enjoyed this uh, little video with me. Uh, I shall see you guys in the next one. Take care of yourselves in this crazy world and be safe, my friends. See you soon. Cheers.